I was going to fight Uber Lilith and make a video on it, but I don't want to show y'all another 7 minute Uber Lilith barb fight. This is actually amazing right here. Shout out to this guy Huxley, or maybe a girl, probably a guy. Give him a sub. I'm going to link in the description and everything else. This is just amazing. Just look. This would lead one to believe that Barb is overpowered, but this is a really, really good build. The way he's got this set up. So he's got Steel Grasp, so he's got basically permanent vulnerable, and he's basically got permanent berserking as well. He said he has no sound because he's uh, listening to music while he's playing. But just look, look how hard he's hitting every time. I gotta definitely see the Paragon board and everything. That's insane. I wonder. I wonder if he has um, plus ultimate skill damage because those those ancients were hitting crazy. There's so many times where the waves just spawn in like unpredictable patterns for me where it's like it's really frustrating. This is a really frustrating fight like when the waves desync there's a lot of stuff but I mean it's also just a lot of learning the mechanics of the fight and timing everything. I mean, look at those ancients hitting for 57 mil. That's crazy. I think I have plus the ultimate damage on like one of my things, but I wonder how much plus ultimate skill damage he's got on his character. Or if even that's what's causing that much damage to occur. Still, even out of like all the, uh, Fights I've seen. That was a gutsy move right there. Out of all out of all the Uber Lilith fights that I've seen, though, the Barb is definitely harder than any other character. And the way that this guy's done it, he's theory crafted the hell out of his character. This has me not this has me not even wanting to worry about doing an Uber Lilith Like I don't think anybody will ever clear faster than this, except for maybe when they nerf her and make her a lot easier. So let's go over, let's go over the character planner right here. So we see he's got disobedience. Wow, he's using Rage of Haragoth. That's kind of nuts. Okay. But look at that. He's got max life on the pants. Damage reduction, damage reduction from close. What's he got on the helm? He's got Max Fury, Max Life, CDR. So he's got all the same weapons that you would use, but he's got... I don't even see any damage to... Uh... He's got damage to close on both of them. So I guess that damage to close is a lot better than you would think, especially probably when you're using Mortal Draw. That's kind of nuts, though. But yeah, he's definitely got some nasty gear. He doesn't even... I think he probably had a, a jewel in the, the necklace. Maybe not, but... I want to see his uh, Paragon boards. Territorial, so he's using territorial for the damage to close. So he's got a bunch of damage to close stacked up. 183 Max Fury. He's got... So what is his damage to close? Damage to close is 189. The Vuln crit damage. Crit strike chance is pretty good too. I don't even think he has any um, damage with ultimate or whatever. 
that's wild though. So he's got, he's using this, territorial, he's using exploit, might, imbiber. So he just went full on, full on damage mode. That's pretty impressive. Let me know what you think. This definitely blew any Uber Lilith fight that I could have done out of the water. I'm going to put the link for his video and for his planner in the description so you can all check it out yourselves. Hope everybody has a great one and I'll catch you on the next one.